President-elect, the Staff Director for the Joint Congressional Committee on Inaugural Ceremonies, Stacey McHatton McBride. The Senate Sergeant-at-Arms, Frank Lumber, and Senate Democratic Leader, Charles E. Schumer. The Speaker of the House of Representatives, Paul D. Ryan. Senate Majority Leader, Mitch McConnell. House Majority Leader, Kevin McCarthy. And House Democratic Leader, Nancy Pelosi. solemnly swear I Donald John Trump do solemnly swear that I will faithfully execute that I will faithfully execute the office of President of the United States the office of President of the United States and will to the best of my ability and will to the best of my ability preserve protect and defend Preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States. The Constitution of the United States. So help me God. So help me God. Congratulations, Mr. President. Yeah. President Carter, President Clinton, President Bush, President Obama, fellow Americans, and people of the world, thank you. We, the citizens of America, are now joined in a great national effort to rebuild our country and restore its promise for all of our people. Together, we will determine the course of America and the world for many, many years to come. We will face challenges. We will confront hardships. But we will get the job done. Every four years, we gather on these steps to carry out the orderly and peaceful transfer of power. And we are grateful to President Obama and First Lady Michelle Obama for their gracious aid throughout this transition. They have been magnificent. Thank you. Today's ceremony, however, has very special meaning because today, we are not merely transferring power from one administration to another. God bless you, and God bless America. Thank you.
God bless America.